Mm-hmm. This is Lord Yada. This is DTM. And we're here to talk about the ATL Mass Men 2020 Let's Art see. Series. Yeah. All right, next on my list for uh, ATL Mass Men 2020 is Big Draz or Domain. He is the uh, proprietor, him and his wife, of 95th Street Tacos. And I was just telling Dan, I met this guy probably through MySpace. <laughs> you know how long ago that was. Uh-huh. Uh, through a site called Soul and Graphics, which was... Uh, put together by uh, Jamario Kindred and his wife. It was a really cool ass site. Probably like, uh, man, that was another thing we used to go on all the time. But anyways, it was, a, it was a website for artists, creators, writers, and stuff like that. So we'd have art battles. Like uh, every week there would be some different thing going on uh, for illustrators and just, uh, people drawing with pencil and then, uh, people in Photoshop doing different things. So I met him through there. So he's always been an artist. Um, uh, more recently, um, so we've, uh, had a friendship through that, but more recently he stepped out and has been doing, uh, this taco thing with his wife. Uh, she's from California and they do these L.A. street tacos with a little kind of, I guess, a little soul flair to them. Mm-hmm. But I, I really appreciate that their their work ethic together um, in pursuing their uh, aims of starting their own business and stuff like that together and, and, and pushing through and uh, bringing some good food to the community. They're directly connected to the arts community because they... Uh, provide food for many of art shows that we've done, mm-hmm. uh, Broken Board, mm-hmm. uh, and, and a lot of events that I've done at the uh, tattoo shop. Um, but it's good to see them working together. They had, uh, for a year, had a contract with Joystick uh, Game Bar mm-hmm. and worked out of there for a year. But they do a lot of community-based stuff, too. Um, they feed the people. feeding the people, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. The feeding the Straight. people who are doing community <laughs> stuff, right. they're in there, yeah. yeah. So directly connected uh-huh. to, to to all of that. Yeah. But um, It's good to have good food when you're doing good things in the community. And not just like our show, but you know, a lot of events they go to, they're, they're, they're events that are geared towards um, the people who show up. Right. And it's not like a, an event that's all about money or trying to charge people through the door. No. It, it, it's... That's just part of the business, but the purpose and the reason of why some of these events exist is because we want to give a place for our own community to relate, right. to congregate, to, to exchange ideas and, and share the space. And they are there. Yeah, They are there. And they are committed to providing um, not just tacos, but a good experience. You feel good about their food. You feel good when you talk to them, yeah. when you meet them. They're very friendly. It's like you're talking to your family. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> I said it better myself. That's the other side of it. Yeah. So, yeah, absolutely. Mm-hmm. Um, we appreciate them for their uh, their work ethic uh, and their support of many community events mm-hmm. that they do that centered around teaching the youth or helping feed the homeless or, uh, you know, and all those different things like yeah. that. So. It's really cool. So check them out. Check 95. Out. 95. Street Tacos. 95th. 95th Street Tacos. Mm-hmm. Yep. Fifth. 95th. 5th. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so that's Big Draz.